for a showdown. Two teams who thrive on pressure and performing on the big occasion. Now they get their wish. Fans the world over are fully focused on this atmospheric stadium where the drama is about to be played out over the next 90 intriguing minutes. Who will prevail? Stay with us on EA TV. are just what you hope for as a spectator a warm welcome my name is Derek Ray and ready with his tactics board to provide all the analysis is Stuart Robson and this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League the group stage and match day one my goodness so much to look forward to it is Club Rouge facing Borussia Dortmund yes cheers Derek well, what an occasion it is for this club and its supporters these are the games that they dream of no doubting they're the underdogs if they can frustrate their opponents, stay in the game up until half-time, you just never know. Hopefully we get a great cut time and maybe even a massive surprise. Possibilities in the centre. Looking for the angle. Miles from goal. Almost going to be the goalkeeper's ball. The line-up then for the hosts. Well, they're going to play with two wingers here. And I'm just a little bit worried that the centre forward could become isolated. Therefore, the midfield players need to get forward as much as possible in this 4-3-3 shape. And introducing the Borussia Dortmund side, Marcel Savica plays with Emre Can in central midfield. Niklas Füllkrug is up front. You never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow, Stuart. What do you think we'll see from him today? I would describe him as majestic when he's playing at his best. He glides past defenders, he's got that ability to run with the ball into open space. He can pick out a pass, he can wriggle out tight situations. He's the most creative player on the field today. Strength and control, a big part of his game. And Bruges unable to hang on to the ball. Malin and Borussia Dortmund in a position of menace. Chan. They couldn't pick out a teammate. It's got to be! Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off! Wonderful to have that in your repertoire! Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box. Just begging someone to get on the end of it. But there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. And back underway. 1-0 it is. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming. get on the end of it. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Marlon. A decent delivery. 
and stopping the danger. Chan. Here's Sancho. And still looking for space. Zavica. And space available inside. Credit to them for winning back possession. What can they do to stop him running at them? Happy to take on the shot. Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. Well, here we can see it again. It's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. So, back underway, with the scoreline standing at 2-0. Gorash. Well, on the cusp of the half-time interval, and the visitors are prospering. Stuart, what have you made of their performance? Yes, it's been a really energetic display for them so far. The pass has been sharp, the movement from the front players has been excellent, and the finishing has been clinical. They will certainly be happy going in at half-time. Very quick thinking there. Through. Now can they counter clinically? Advantage, Borussia Dortmund. Grant. Return to Sancho. Superbly read and executed. Oh, a tremendous reflex action there from the keeper. Well, he didn't have long to react, did he? But that's a top-class save, I have to say. Can he pick out? Wonderful header, excellent goalkeeping. Well, Dortmund have been dominant in every department. Just look how many chances they've created. They've been excellent today, I have to say. Ian Madsen. It's with Mats Hummers. He's in control of the situation. Emre Can. And very nicely positioned to win it back. And the 
there is going to be stoppage to could it be and there it is still life left in this game and they have the momentum now Well, as you can see, they finish this really easily. They don't give the keeper a chance, do they? That's a good goal. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, he's been brilliant. He finished his goals really well. He's shown a great awareness of how to find space. And his movement has caused them all sorts of problems. Surely he'll get his hat-trick in the second half. Well, underway once more. And it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Come as a free kick here. A 
And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there.
well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Five minutes remaining, and one thing is certain, no one is leaving, because it's still close. Well, I think the fans are doing everything they can to get their team back into this. But can they find that moment of inspiration and get an equaliser? people Stuart well that was a great performance his understanding of how to find space was brilliant today and of course he scored two really good goals 